Hi and welcome to Dodgeland High School for this evening's Trailways matchup. Palmyra Eagle visiting the Dodgeland Trojans this evening. Cade Fleischmann, number five, in to kick it away for the Panthers and we're underway, a short kick and Dakota Greenenberg will come forward and he's brought down at the 39 yard line. Nolan Kobidelski in on the stop. So here we are, first and 10. Cody Nails goes under center for the Trojans. Palmyra Eagle in a four-man front as here's Nails to give off to a strike and he falls forward for maybe a gain of one. Nate Sullivan in on the stop, number 54. It'll be second down nine to go for Dodgeland here. Cody Nails back under center. Younger, Zach Younger, wide to the left as here's a toss out. Nate A strike looking, cuts back up the middle and is stood up, getting away and gets past at, at least five defenders. Nobody took him down and Nate A strike picks up a first down for Dodgeland. I'm telling you right now, this game's gonna be won by the the second chance this evening. As here's Nails and a quarterback, and he loses the ball. It is gonna be recovered by Palmyra Eagle. It's number 44, Connor Sullivan. And Palmyra Eagle takes over. A broken play had appeared, and the Panthers will take over. Palmyra Eagle starts first and 10 in the shotgun formation as here is a pump fake from Brandon Wildey. Here comes Pergandi and that one is thrown incomplete. Good pressure there from Dalton number 64. So we'll go second down at 10, ball at the 32 yard line. No huddle for Palmyra Eagle just going to the line with their as here's, a, here's the pass, Wildy a short pass over to Owen Butenhoff and he's brought down immediately. I believe that was Nate A strike in on the stop. Third and four now for Palmyra Eagle, another shotgun formation. Three off to the left and they're gonna call the trips on this as here's Wildy looking off to pass. Pocket breaking down and he's brought down. Nate A strike, number 44. And good containment by the remainder of the defensive line and nothing doing for the Panthers. This punt is blocked and Dodge Jim will leave it here. That was Cade Fleischman in punt formation Good work by Dalton Paragondi and the remainder of the defense. Nice work and nothing doing after a good turnover by the Panthers. Dodgeland takes over again. From the 37 yard line, Dodgeland starts again, first and 10. Nails goes under center. Here is the reverse to Matt Moynihan, number 35. He goes off to the left side and has a first down, down the left sideline and he's ridden out of bounds. Number eight, Nolan Kodoblowski in on the stop. First and 10 for the Trojans, the 43 yard line. As here is Nails looking over and that one intended for Jordan Marsh incomplete. It looked like he was, he's covered in traffic there. A number of Panthers in the vicinity. Second and 10 from the 43 once again. Younger is split to the right here. Here's Nails, here's another reverse. Matt Moynihan slips a tackle! And a good, strong tackle there. That was Fleischman again, number five. Fleischman is a sophomore, 6'2", 180 for the Panthers. It'll be third down and seven here after a gain of three. Moynihan, Matt Moynihan, and Zach Younger off to the left side as here's the run to Nate A-Strike. A-Strike right up the middle, first down! And he's brought down by Cody Lofsky. First down for the Trojans. So A-Strike with some good running in the last play. Dodgeland, another first down. 
now at the 30, the 25 yard line rather, as here's another give to A strike up the middle, and he's brought down after a good gain. Pretty good hole from the Trojans, and we have an injured lineman, I believe that is, I believe that is Chris Gomez. So Chris Gomez limping off number 79. I've had the opportunity to be right next to him as his, his left guard as Kane Schmidt, I believe, was in. Here's the run right up the middle. Dakota Greenenberg, and he's roped down. He's very close to a first down in this. Matt Harrigus, number 70, in on the stop. Ball spotted at the 17-yard line. It'll be third down and one, we'll say, as Moynihan comes in motion. Here's the run, Nate A's strike, and he's going to fall forward. It looks like he might have enough for a first down. I believe he does. Yes, he does. The official gives it to him, and Dodgeland moving the ball efficiently this drive. First and 10, 13 yard line for the Trojans, as here's Cody Nails. The toss out to Nate A's strike. Hits the hole hard, and he's brought down. Nice tackle by Nate Sullivan, I believe, number 54. Gain of a couple yards. And now it's second and nine after a gain of a yard. Younger goes in. They'll have a tight end to the left side. That's Jordan Marsh, number 89. Nails comes under center, and here's another reverse. Matt Moynihan, Moynihan shoots through the hole and gains a couple here. We'll say four. Going to be third down. And about five, 520 to go here in the first quarter. No score still as here's Zach Younger out to the right as here's Nate A strike pushes through the hole and he is pushing towards the end zone. Is he in? Yes, touchdown Dodgeland. What a play, Nate A strike with a second effort. A good hole on the left side and Dodgeland takes the lead. 6-0 with 5.03 to go. Zach Schmidt, number 21, in for the extra point. This one is up and through the uprights. Good. Good snap and hold. And the Trojans lead 7-0 over the Palmyra Eagle Panthers. A nice long drive. And 5.03 to go. 7-0 Trojans will be back after this. Half. Zach Schmidt in to kick it away for the Trojans. Going from left to right, and we're underway. Booming kick, end over end, down near the five yard line, and is picked up. And he's brought down Dan Moynihan in on that, as well as Zach Younger. Nolan Kotolovsky was the returner, number eight. First down and 10 for Palmyra Eagle here. Shotgun formation, Brandon Wildey, number one with three receivers to the bottom of your screen. Here's the pass over a short route, slant over the middle, and that is caught number 30, Morgan Carpenter. And he's very close to a, very close to a first down, and they're gonna give it to him. Palmyra Eagle, first down. Same formation here for the Panthers. Three men to the bottom of your screen. Carpenter, the top of your screen on the right side is, here's the pass back over the middle, caught, and he's ridden down immediately. I, Brandon Damney Hammond, rather, he's on the reception. Zach Younger brings him down as well as Derek Anthalt. First down for the Panthers. Palmyra Eagle quickly moving the ball. Two passes, two completions, two first downs. Here's Wildy on the pass again. Comes over the middle. Another slant route, and it is caught once again by Carpenter. Moynihan brings him down. Matthew Moynihan, that is. Another gain of five, we'll say. So now second and second and five now, ball, the 43-yard line. Wildy, another pass going downfield and nearly intercepted Zach Younger diving for it, and they were not on the same page. The intended receiver, I believe, was Owen Butenhoff, number seven. Good coverage. Third and five from the 43 is Wildy. Same formation once again for Palmyra, as here is the pass. Wildy looking, throws it over, and it is... Dropped incomplete. Zach Younger brings Budenhoff to the ground. There is a flag on the play. I believe it's a hold. The last call was a hold against Palmyra Eagle. They backed him up 10 yards. It's now third and 15. 
There will be trips to the right side of the top of your screen. Oz will be into the shotgun formation. Here is the pass. Airing it out, going downfield, and it is batted down incomplete. Matt Moynihan on the coverage there, that the intended receiver, Morgan Carpenter. Good coverage there. Good snap at a spiraling punt. Zach Schmidt would be on the return, and that one is downed at the 40-yard line, and number 22 who's not on my scorecard, unfortunately, for the Panthers. It'll be downed at the 40-yard line. First and 10 coming for the Trojans. So here come the Trojans again. First and 10 from the 40-yard line. Younger, as motion goes in motion, Moynihan goes in motion, and nothing doing on that one. Good work by the Panthers' defensive line. I believe that was Greenenberg on the carry. He lost a yard, they'll say second and 11 now. Ball at the 39 yard line, 2.51 to go, second and 11. As here's Nails under center. The play action, Nails airing it out downfield for Dan Moynihan and he overshot him, he was wide open. Nobody in five yards of Dan and nothing doing. A good call, just couldn't connect. Third down and 11 from the 39 yard line. Younger to the bottom of your screen here. Nails comes under center. Moynihan, Matt Moynihan goes in motion. Here's the pass, Nails going out towards Younger and it is hauled in. What a catch, an over the shoulder catch. And he's brought down at about the 40 yard line. Number 21, Jacob Bear brings him down. But a great call from Coach Miller and Dodgeland has another first down. So Dodgeland starts again, first down from the 40 yard line. Now in Panther territory. Jordan Marsh on the right side as tight end. Here's Dan Moynihan up the middle and good hard earned yards there. He's brought down. Eh, gain of five yards. Number 64, Cole Fleshman. He's in on the stop. So after a gain of four yards, it's second and six. Everybody tight now. Jordan Marsh to the right side. As here is the toss out, Matt Moynihan, a good cutout, and Palmyra Eagle right there. Nothing doing on that one. Maybe he got a yard. Jake Prodzinski in on the stop, number 31. Third down and five yards. At the 35 yard line, Younger split out to the right side here. Nails under center, and he muffs. The snap and Palmyra Eagle takes over. Issues on the exchange and Palmyra Eagle takes over again. So here goes the Panthers again with 104 to go in the first quarter. A little bit of an issue between the center and the quarterback on the last one. Shotgun formation for Wilde. And here's the pass. Looking over, over in the little opening is Carpenter and he's thrown down by Jordan Marsh, number 89, he has a first down. First and 10 for the Panthers. They're at the 49 yard line now. Trips to the bottom of your screen on the left side. And here's Wild going off the pass. Intercepted over the middle to Cody Greenberg. And the quarterback brings him down. Wild, but what a play! Anticipated it, and he threw it right to him. What a play! So Palmyra Eagles had two takeaways and they have not been able to do anything with them. Dodgeland starts again, first and 10. As here is the run by Nate Strike, and he didn't get anything. Good work by the defensive line for Palmyra Eagle. Butenhoff in on the stop for Palmyra Eagle, no gain. And it'll be second down. So we will conclude the first quarter. Coach Miller just decided to let it run out. So Dodgeland will go into the second quarter leading seven nothing. Ball is placed at the 29 yard lines. We're going from 
right to left across your screen. I guess that only works in radio when they say that. But first and ten, as here's the run, Matt Moynihan with a lead blocker ahead of him. Moynihan's got a lot of space. What a block by Nate Strike, and Moynihan walks into the end zone. Touchdown, Dodgeland. What a block by Nate Strike on the outside. And it is now 13 to zero, Dodgeland. Coach Sweeney was just talking about that last play. You're not gonna find a better block in high school as Zach Schmidt boots through the extra point and it is now 14-0 Dodgeland. So Dakota Greenberg's interception translates into another touchdown for the Trojans and just underway with the second quarter, 14-0. Zach Schmidt boots it away end over end as this one sails to about the five yard line and the return by Kodoblinski and he is taken down in a ball of heat, I believe it was Mitchell Crutchen, number 50. So Palmyra Eagle starts again, this time at about the 24 yard line, first and 10, trips to the bottom of your screen, and Wild back to the shotgun here is a run off the left side and he's brought down. That was Ryan Nye, number 52, we have a flag on the play. So a loss of eight in that last play with a, with a hold. As here's the pass, Wild going down the sideline and it's out of the reach of uh, Budenhoff. A good ball, a decent ball by Wild and couldn't do it, incomplete. A couple substitutions. It'll be third down and long now for Palmyra Eagle, Wild back to the shotgun, same formation as Past couple plays, here's Wild over the middle and it's caught Budenhoff and he's falling forward. He's gonna be just shy of the first down. Is that Derek Antholt in on the stop, I believe? It was Derek Antholt and a fourth down and short coming up. Fourth and, fourth and two. Fourth and, this could be a big play in the game. Can Palmyra Eagle hang in it? Fourth and two now. Ball at the 42 yard line and we have a flag. I believe it's gonna be a false start. Delay of game. Thanks coach. It'll be delay of game, that'll push him back five yards and we might see a punt here from Palmyra. And that's exactly what they'll do. They'll punt it away. Fleischman in punt formation for Palmyra Eagle, Zach Schmidt back deep for the return, a low snap, and I believe they are going to, there's a, there's a slip ball, and Dodgson's gonna take it right there. So just to reiterate from the last call, they are saying the punter's knee was down, Dodgeland takes over as Nails quickly gets the handoff to Nate Astrike, and he's brought down immediately, that was, as there's a flag on the play. Number 22 and on the stop, Lyle Crow. It was a chop block on that last one, so Dodgers will start again. It's now first at 25, ball at the 30 yard line. As here's motion coming across the run, right up the middle, Nate A strike. And he's gonna get a good chunk of yardage there. He's brought down from 31, I believe that is Pranzinski, I believe. Gain of five, five yards. Second and 20 from the 25 now. Zach Younger to the right, Matt Moynihan wide to the left, the bottom of your screen is here is Nails. Here is the pass over the middle and it's dropped, nearly intercepted. He threw it to him, right to him. That was Owen Butenhoff and a laser from Nails. Maybe if he'd have thrown it any lighter than that, I bet you you probably caught it. That was a laser ball from Nails on a slant route to Zach Younger and Dodge and lucky to get away with it. So the Trojans out of sync right now. Third and 25 back to the, they lose five more as Dodge making a lot of motion on this. Zach Younger goes under center, rather 
Nails goes under center. Nails, the pocket collapsing, and he's brought down. Palmyra Eagle brought the house, and they got to him. Nate Sullivan, number 52, went on the sack. Pergandi in punt formation after some substitution issues. Pergandi lifts a high booming kick, a short kick, and that one is going to bounce down at about the 12 yard line. I believe Zach Younger down that. Yes, he did. And Palmyra Eagle takes over again, so a little disjointed on that. So Palmyra Eagle starts again. 8.45 to go in the second quarter. Dodgeland leads 14 to nothing. First and 10 ball to 12 yard line. Three men to the bottom of your screen. Three receivers to the bottom of your screen. Wild in the shotgun, here's the pass. Going down the left sideline and what a catch. Is Josh Chorchek over Dan Moynihan. So now at the 40 yard line, Palmyra Eagle quickly moving as here's Wild. Moot steps up in the pocket, gets away from a couple defenders and is brought down in a pile. And we have, there's a possible fumble. They're saying it was on the ground. He gained five yards out of that scramble. Ryan Nye was in pursuit, number 52. Second and five now, Palmyra Eagle quickly moving. Three men to the bottom of your screen again, three receivers. Here is the carry up the middle, and nothing doing. Ryan Nye got off his block almost immediately, and he took down Jake Bronzinski. Third and five now. He might have lost a half a yard, as here's shotgun formation for Wild again. Here's the pass. Rolling off to his right, here comes Pergani, and he slips and falls. And a flag is down. So the last penalty was a hold. And here is the punt from Fleischman. That one just got away. A end over end kick will bounce down to about the 34 and a half yard line. A, decent, a good punt there. And Pel Dodgeland takes over again. Nothing doing after, and they're moving fairly well there with some short passing and the defense steps up again. Good work by the Trojan D. 14 nothing with 6.54 to go in the second quarter. Here comes Cody Nails, number 14 back out. First and 10 from the 34 yard line. Zach Younger to the bottom of your screen. Number 16, Matt Moynihan up on top. As here's the toss outside, Dan Moynihan gets past the defender and is ridden out of bounds. Good work. Lonnie Golish, number 22. And so we got a half a yard in the last one second and 10. Nails back under center and we have a flag, I believe it's a false start. Dodging very disjointed to nearing the end of the quarter. It'll be second and 15 now, ball at the 30 yard line. Dan Moynihan in the backfield as a single back as here's the run outside Matt Moynihan and he is ridden down. Good work by the D line. I believe that's number 54, I believe Nate Sullivan. Matt Moynihan tried scooting around the corner and that didn't work this time. So after another loss, it is now third and 21. Ball to the 24 yard line. Dan Moynihan back to the backfield as here's the run up the middle. Moynihan, Dan Moynihan gets a couple and will be well shy of the first down. And it appears Dodgen's gonna punt. I believe I said Dalton Pergandi was the punter the last time. It's actually Nate A-Strike and Kind of a high punt, a strike gets it away. A swirling punt and it is caught and then Zach Younger drives him to the ground. I believe that was Kotolovsky. His, it appears it was muffed. Well, I should know they're gonna give it to the Panthers either way. It'll be at the 43 yard line. Good work by the special teams unit. Zach Younger flying downfield. 
5.15 to go in the second quarter. It is 14-0 Dodgeland. First and 10 as Palmyra Eagle changing it up here. They have two men out wide. They have one to the right, one to the left. Wild to the shotgun. They have a couple of tight ends as a screen. As that's what it's going to be. And Butenhoff got a couple. A good call from Palmyra Eagle. He's brought down, I believe it was Pergandi. Welcome to Wisconsin, by the way. The geese were coming down in the last play there. Second down and six from the 47 as Wild back to the shotgun. Rolling out right, looking deep as it's thrown over the middle. He was open. Danny Hammond incomplete. He was wide open. There's a opening in the gap there. And they couldn't execute. Elmire Eagle showing this evening that they're a, a pass happy team. They have looked to pass the ball just about everywhere. They've hit a couple slants as they have trips to the bottom of the screen on this one. Single man at the top, he sees Wild to pass. Looking over the middle, it's caught. Again, that's Hammond and a first down. Jordan Marsh brings him to the ground, but not after he picks up a Panther first down. As now they'll put three men to the left. To the bottom is Morgan Carpenter, 4.17 to go. Wild back to the shotgun. Here's Wild to pass. Going over and it is broken up. Incomplete. Budenhoff, the intended receiver and a, a good ball. Palmyra has been throwing a lot of those this evening. Just some, some slamps up the sideline. Nothing has really converted as of yet. It'll be second and 10. Ball, the 39-yard line once again. Second and 10 for Palmyra Eagles. Same formation as before. As that the snap is muffed, he throws it over the middle, and it's just out of the reach of number 11, Josh Kerstozik. Had to get some help from Mr. Thompson right next door. Incomplete, third down and 10 coming. Now they have trips to the bottom of your screen. Wild back in the shotgun as here is the pass over. Looking, rainbows down the sideline and broken up. Derek Anhol denying any of that. That would have been a pretty nice catch along the sideline there. Good work by Derek. And it'll be fourth and 10 for Palmyra. Palmyra Eagle just spent a timeout on that last one. Fourth and 10 now. Ball at the 39 yard line, they're gonna go for it. They have a couple timeouts, why not? Here's a shotgun formation, wild. Rolling out to his left. Pass it over the middle, and it's just out of the reach once again A Budenhoff. That was another, he was there. It was, it was there, just a little out of reach, incomplete. And Dodgeland takes over once again. Good D by Dodgeland. 3.49 to go. It's first and 10 for the Trojans after another good stop on defense. They have really showed up to play. As Cody Nails under center, here is the toss out, Nate A strike, cuts the corner up the middle and is very close to a first down. Got tripped up, he could have gotten more out of that. Nice run. First and 10 now, ball right at midfield, same play, A strike up the middle and he's upended after a gain of three yards, a good tackle there. That was Cade Fleischman, number five. And we now have a, once again, welcome to Wisconsin, a goose flying over the field as here's Nails. Going downfield, throwing the goose down, and he just got out of reach incomplete. Zach Younger as they were going for it all. A good ball from Cody and just out of the reach of Zach. Looked like that goose I was running off. It was just coming off the field there, Coach. I, I'd suppose everybody was gasping. Whoa, there it comes. So now it's third and six from the 46 yard line. Nails comes down. Younger and Moynihan to the bottom of your screen. Nails rolling out and he's brought down. I believe they're gonna get him on a hold two as there's a flag behind that. Jake Prozinski is in on the sack, number 31. And so after the hold, Dodgeland will punt it away. Here's Nate A strike, number 44. Cody Linsky, as this is, he's on the return, an end-over-end -end punt, 
And he's going to try to go to the outside, and a nice tackle. I believe that was Brennan Jordan. Yes, that was Brennan Jordan, number 26. Had a good stop, good open field tackle, and Palmyra Eagle will set up shop at the 23. 2.15 to go here in the second quarter. Dodgeland retaining the lead at 14 to nothing right now. It is first and 10, ball to the 22 yard line. I misspoke on that, that last play. As he's wild, a low snap. This was not wild this time as that is Hunter Griffiths, number, number two. Wild not in on this play here. Make some personnel changes. Clock still running here. Now under two minutes to go, 144 and counting. It is second down and long as here is the run to the outside and good hard running. Not gonna lot to very much at all, in fact. That's gonna be Jake Prasinski. I believe Jordan Marsh was in there on the stop. Palmyra Eagle, they wound the clock down to about 51 seconds and then they burned a timeout trying to keep the Trojan offense off the field here, it appears. It is going to be third down and 23. Let's see if Dodgeham will use a timeout after this play, if, it is a, if it's a run play. Let's see if they get another shot at it. Wild, actually rather, that'll be Griffiths in the backfield as here's a little draw play up the middle and Prozinski gets a couple, five yards, four or five yards and we have a, I believe a timeout. It's Fleischman coming in punt formation for Palmyra Eagle after the last issue. He brought his foot down as they're gonna have to bring in another Panther into the play. Fleischman had his knee down the last time on the punt as this is a high punt. He grabs it and it's blocked. It's gonna be blocked and Matt Moynihan grabs it in the back of the end zone. It's a touchdown. What a play. And they had at least four Trojans in the back of the end, in the back, back by the punter. And another breakdown on special teams for Pelmire Eagle. What a play, what a play. Zach Schmidt boots that one through the uprights. It's good. And anything can happen in any amount of time. So with 37 seconds to go in the second quarter, Dodgeland extends their lead to 21 to nothing off of a blocked punt. And then they recovered it in the end zone. Matt Moynihan, that is to say, in the end zone. 21 nothing. So here's Schmidt to kick it away now. 21 nothing as here's a squib kick up the middle. A slow bouncer, and it is going to be recovered. And he gets through the hole, does Morgan Carpenter. And he's brought down about the 35-yard line, exactly at the 35-yard line. Ty Bader in on the stop. Thank you, Coach. Ty Bader in on the stop. So Palmyra Eagle will start with 31.5 seconds to go. First and 10, ball at the 35 yard line. Here's Griffiths going deep down the sideline and it is caught. Josh Krizorjek, number 11 in on the catch and then he is driven to the ground by Zach Schmidt and he is still down. Krizorjek walked off on that last play. I believe the wind was knocked out of him. A nice tackle by Zach Schmidt after he caught it. It'll be first down. Clock is still running here. First and 10 ball to the 43 yard line. Took a long time to get that snap off. Griffiths going downfield in a double coverage. It's caught. Moynihan keeping him with five seconds and he's brought down. Good work by Matt Moynihan to keep him in the middle of the field. And Palmyra Eagle will spend their final timeout with four seconds to go. It's a big thing here. Four and a half seconds to go. They're gonna have that trips looked off to the left side here for Palmyra Griffiths. He's gonna have Brodzinski off on his right side. Here is the pass. Throws over the middle and it's broken up. That was Jordan Marsh. 
read it like a book, and it's incomplete. This is Cade Fleischman, number five. He's in snap, placement, kick. This one is up. Good hold. It's good. Dodgeland got through, but couldn't block it. And Palmyre Eagle can get a field goal to end the first half. It is now Trojans 21, Panthers 3. Good half by the Trojans. Some good passing from the Panthers to end the half has been very efficient so far in that. And we're back now as the third quarter just about to get underway. Zach Schmidt to kick it away for the Trojans. It is 21 to three. Dodgeland controlled the first half. Palmyra Eagle able to get something going late. And here's Schmidt. And a booming kick end over end. This one going to be fielded about the 10 yard line. Coming up the middle and Carpenter brought down at about the 43, 44 yard line. I believe that was Ty Bader. Zach Younger, I apologize. Number 16, Zach Younger. And he's a little slow to get up. And we're back now. As the third quarter just about to get underway, Zach Schmidt to kick it away for the Trojans. It is 21 to three. Dodgeland controlled the first half. Palmyra Eagle able to get something going late. And here's Schmidt and a booming kick end over end. This one gonna be fielded about the 10 yard line. Coming up the middle and Carpenter brought down at about the 43, 44 yard line. I believe that was Ty Bader. Zach Younger, I apologize, number 16, Zach Younger, and he's a little slow to get up. Palmyra Eagle comes out in twins here, first and 10, ball at about the 43 yard line as Brandon Wild is back in. He has to get rid of it quickly. And a good catch right there by Danny Hammond. And he Wild got pummeled as he got hit out of the out of the side of the pocket. And it was Pergande, I believe. Gain of five. Second down at five. And once again back to the twins for Palmyra. Here's Wild rolling out to the right. A low throw incomplete to Butenhoff. He was open, just a awkward throw. And he couldn't make it, couldn't make it work. Third down and five. Trips formation now for Palmyra Eagle on a third and five at the 48 yard line. Here's the snap to Wild. Rolling out to the right, here comes Nye and a low throw. It is, I believe, incomplete. Yes, intended for Butenhoff, and it appears Palmyra Eagle's gonna punt. Fourth down and five, as Fleischman will punt it away for Palmyra Eagle. So after the one good catch, here's a end over end punt to Zach Schmidt. Schmidt, past one defender, and a decent return, he's brought down. Prodzinski in on the stop. So from the 36 yard line, first and 10 for Dodgeland. Cody Nails goes under center. Younger to the top of the screen is here is Nate A strike. Up the middle and well, just a little outside and he's brought down. Number eight, Kotlopski. Kopi Kotlopski in on the stop. After a good gain, seven yards, eight yards make that. Second down, we'll call it two. As a quick snap, Dakota Greenenberg got a yard and a late flag. Lonnie Garbish came in and he hit, took a hit on Cody Nails, the quarterback, and they're not gonna stand for that. So a personal foul on the Panthers, again, he came after Cody Nails and 
That'll move the Trojans down to the 39 yard line. First and 10, here's Nails. And uh, laundry on the field. So it'll be first and 15 after a false start. Quick snap and up the middle is, I believe, Greenenberg. Gain of two yards. Second and 13 now, ball the 42 yard line. After a gain of two, here comes Nails to the line. Panthers showing blitz and the center is dropped to the ground. That was Kane Schmiedema, number 75, who's ridden back. So one more of those by the, according to the officiating crew and he's done. Gain of five, or uh, as a strike loses the ball and I believe Pellmeyer has it. Nate strike got the ball quickly and it just fell out. I guess, I mean, Palmyra Eagle takes over again and the momentum is right now hanging in the balance. Palmyra Eagle takes over at the 33, 32 rather. Much easier to play with the lead right now. Palmyra Eagle getting in the head of Dodgeland as here is the pass, wild. Throws over and it's nearly intercepted. It went right, Matt, right to Matt Moynihan. Not a very good pass by Wild. Is a little ahead of his receiver, and it'll be second and ten. Coach Sweeney was agreeing or putting out a good stat. Three fumbles in this game. Cannot have that. This is now second and ten, 32-yard line. Wild throws it over and it is dropped. A good pass from Wild is just a little low. The intended receiver, Kristozik, number 11, and third down. It was a little slant on the left side of the field. Decent coverage, third down and 10. The Meyer Eagle has not run the ball yet in the third quarter. Third down and 10 as a trips to the top of your screen. As here's the pass, Wild over the middle, and it is incomplete, just out of the hands of Danny Hammond. A lot of short routes from Palmyra Eagle. And it appears Palmyra Eagle is going to punt. Fleischman in punt formation now for the Panthers as he'll get this one away. Marsh was just about there. A, a duck type of punt. Zach Schmidt picks it up. Many defenders there and gets across midfield. Good work by Zach. And he's brought down about the 47 yard line. Danny Hammond in on the stop. From the 47 yard line, first and 10 for the Trojans. Here is Nate Strike. Sheds a couple tackles and is ridden out of bounds. Cripes, he took three Panthers with him there. Morgan Carpenter in on the stop. That was not taking one guy. I'm just going to say that right now. He could have had a one-person tackle there. Carpenter's going to come off number 30. Ezekiel Rodriguez, number 10, is going to replace Carpenter, who just came off. It's now second and eight after a gain of two. Here is the toss outside. Nate strike cuts upfield and falls forward for a gain of five yards. Maybe he got six. They'll spot him exactly at the 40 yard line. It'll be third down and three yards. Dodgeland taking their time, moving the ball down the field here. 7.35 is its third down as here's the run up the middle. Dakota Greenenberg falling forward with the pile and I think he might have got it. Hard running right up the gut. A quick snap and I believe he got it. Did he? Yes he did by a bot. Two yards. Nice work by the Trojan offensive line. They don't get a lot of credit, but they sure deserve it on that one. First down. First down from the 36 yard line. Cody Nails. As Palmyra Eagle brings in a blitz A strike on the carry, and he got a couple. I believe Carpenter was in on the stop there, Morgan Carpenter. So after a gain of 
a yard, it'll be second and nine. Gain of two yards, second and nine, second and eight. Here's the reverse as Cody Nails. Nothing doing, and he's brought down Morgan Carpenter again. Good work on D. Trojan's a little slow to get out of the huddle here. It's going to be third and 13 at about the 38. And Dodgeland is going to have to use a timeout as he play clock running down. Nice evening for football here. Third and 13 coming up. Ball to the 38-yard line after the timeout by the Trojans. And Nails to the line. A quick snap. Nails out the pass. Going downfield for Zach Younger and just out of reach. A couple yards out of bounds, incomplete. And it looks like the Trojans will punt it away. This is a good, good route from Younger and just a little, just a little outside in the, on the pass. So a strike comes back in to punt it away, number 44. High snap and an end over end punt by A strike. Here comes Zach Schmidt down to field it and a great punt. That's going to be downed at the five yard line. And there is Zach Younger sliding into second base to retrieve the ball. So that'll be down to the five yard line. And the Panthers will start again. They've been backed up all evening, it seems like. They really haven't, with the exception of that field goal drive, they really just haven't gotten anything going at all. So the Panthers backed up by their own end zone. First down, three down linemen for the Trojans, rather one down lineman. As a D tackles, here's the trips to the bottom of your screen. The pass over to Carpenter, sheds a tackle and is brought down. Good tackle by Matt Moynihan. Nothing doing after he broke it, after he broke the tackle. Second and five, we'll say, second and, second and four. Second and six, I'm sorry, gain of four. Second and six now from the nine yard line. Same formation as the last one, as here's the pass over. And Butenhoff brought down, I believe that's Mitchell Crutchen, number 50. And he's going to be just shy of the first down, a gain of five yards. A short third down, third and one for Palmyra Eagle here. With the trips to the top of your screen as here's the run up the middle and a first down. Hard running from Jake Pronsinski. I believe that was Matt Moynihan on the stop. First down, it's... Coach is saying it there. First down, ball at the 25-yard line. Now they have twins. Here's Wild in the shotgun. As he rolls out to the right, throws it over and out of the reach of Danny Hammond, incomplete. Second and 10 now. Now they have the trips to the top of your screen. Here is Wild, rolls out to the right, looking for it, and he gets it over on the, down the sideline to Owen Butenhoff. There's a flag, and I believe it's gonna be, a, it's in the area of a hold. Uh, so a hold on the last, Play. They just about had a first down if they wouldn't have hold, held. That's from the spot of the foul. It's now second and 25. Ball to the 10 yard line as they're backed up again. Here's a run up the middle. That's Brozinski and good yardage. He got about 14 on it. Jordan Marsh is in on the stop. Third down and 11, we'll call it. Twins now for Palmyra Eagle as it's third down and a long 11 as Wild muffs the snap, 
looking, looking, and throws it down the sideline, well out of bounds, incomplete. And Palmyra Eagle looks like they're gonna punt it away. Fleischman in punt formation now for the Panthers. Zach Schmidt is back deep to return. Here's Fleischman and nearly blocked by Marsh. A spiraling kick that's gonna bounce right at midfield and is gonna roll out of bounds. Lonnie Garbish, number 22, downed it otherwise. And the Trojans will set up once again now with 2.52 to go in the third quarter. No scoring in this quarter, it's still 21 to three Trojans. First and 10 now, they'll have two men to the top of your screen, Younger and I believe it's Matt Moynihan up there as here comes a stunt and a stunt up the middle from Connor Sullivan, number 44, and they're gonna get him on an encroachment. So five painless yards there for the Trojans. They have an easy first and five here, an easier first and five. Cody Nails making some adjustments before going down under center. As here's the run to Matt Moynihan, a little counter up the middle and as a first down, hard running and a, just a little follow through with his blockers and a first down. So Moynihan with some, Matt Moynihan with some tough running right there. That was a first down for the Trojans from the 33 yard line. Here's Nails to give off to a strike and gets past the defender. Hard yards and he's brought down to about the 26 yard line. Good running from Nate a strike. A good cutback and a gain of six yards. I'm telling you coach, it's strong. It's, it's a good thing to have strong running backs. It's second and four now, they right back to a strike. He is the lineman that was Pergani was blown right off the line. And that's, that's the first time I've seen him have any issues this evening, coach. He's been, Pergani's been on uh, just about everything it seems like. And so he lost a couple there. Third down and we'll say six. Here we go. Here we go. Let's go. Third and six now, ball to the 28 yard line. Nails goes under center. And here's the run for Matt Moynihan and nothing doing on that good defense by Palmyra Eagle. I believe that was Gar Garbish in on the stop. Nate Sullivan rather is in on the stop. Dodge him will punt away now with a minute to go in the third quarter. Nate A strike in punt formation. He had a couple of those good runs in this drive. Palmyra waiting for a, waiting for a fake as a strike a line drive down to the corner and just into the end zone man oh man he looked like uh tim maste or justin vogel or something like that there he's just about got it and palmyra eagle will start at the 20 yard line so here come the panthers again it is first and 10 45 seconds to go in the third quarter 21 to 3 shotgun formation as here comes wild a Kind of a low snap, he rolls out to his left. Here comes Ryan Nye, here he comes again. This one's thrown well out of the reach of Carpenter, incomplete. Ryan Nye with the hurry. Second down and 10, ball of the 20 yard line once again. The trips to the top of your screen now to the left of the quarterback, Wild. Here's the pass, Wild looking over and it's caught. And he's gonna have a first down and more after a broken tackle. And he's brought down, Dan Moynihan was in on the stop. That was Josh Krizorjek, number 11. And a first down for the Panthers. Trips to the bottom of your screen to the right of Wild. Taking their time with this play here. Here's Wild, here's the snap. Over the middle, it's caught. And he's gonna be brought down. He's got enough for another first down. I believe that was Danny Hammond. Yes, it was. And I believe that it's gonna be the end of the quarter. They're gonna call it. So we will conclude the third quarter. The Panthers are driving. It is 21 to three, Palmyra Eagle still in it. 
Good game so far. 21-3, hard-hitting game. Fun game to watch. 21-3, Trojans. So we'll start the fourth quarter on a chilly, now September 9th. It is going to be first and 10, ball the 43-yard line for the Palmyra Eagle Panthers, who trailed the Trojans 21-3. As here is the pass, Wild rolls out, and it is caught, then dropped. Good work by Matt Moynihan. He got in there and knocked the ball out. I believe that was Carpenter, the intended receiver. Second down and 10 now for the Panthers. Wild back in as the trips to the top now. Here's the run up the middle and good work by Dalton Pergani. He got off his block and Pronzinski, minimal yardage. They'll give him a half a yard, we'll say. Third down and 10 for Palmyra Eagle as they'll now have twins. Here's the pass, Wild looking out to his right, rainbows down the right sideline and it's broken up. Good work there by Matt Moynihan along the right sideline, the intended receiver, Morgan Carpenter. So the Panthers will go for it once again. Here's Twins now, fourth and 10 from the 45 and Dodgeland will spend a timeout. Coach Miller wants to talk it over. Coach Selkert as well. In Green Lake, it is fourth and ten as a type of rugby style as a line drive kick that's going to bounce at about the 18-yard line. It was a short stance from Fleischman, number five, about half the distance from where he's usually punting and marked at the 18. So 11 minutes to go here in the game. 21 to three, Dodgeland. First down and 10. Here's Cody Nails under center. A run up the middle that is Greenberg, I believe, and Troy Stocky got caught up under that number 51, and he's still down. You don't want to see that. Frank Huber replaces Troy Stocky. Stocky got rolled up on on that last play. So Huber is in, is here a quick snap here. Here's Nate A-Strike, shovels off a defender and is very close to a first down. Once again, I was saying with A-Strike, you gotta bring a couple guys with him to, to bring him down. He's just, he's, he's that strong and Dodgson has used it to their advantage. Trojans quickly come into the line here. It'll be third and two, ball to the 27. Nails comes under center and a quick snap right to A-Strike and Gets past a fumble, fumble, and I believe the Panthers have it again. We'll check. If that is, that's the fourth. And it is going to be Palmyra's ball, Palmyra Eagle ball. The fourth fumble of the evening by the Trojans. So Palmyra Eagle starts again, first and 10, ball to the 33 yard line. Twins again for the Panthers. As here's the pass, Wild going over into the flat and he is pummeled. Prozinski had nowhere to go, that was Jordan Marsh, number 89, Dan Moynihan also there. Second and 14 now, ball to the 37 yard line. Now they'll have trips to the top of your screen. Here's Wild. Goes over into the slant and it is caught. That is Carpenter and he's driven down. Dakota Greenenberg was there. Also, I believe that was Derek Antholt. Yes, it was. Derek Antholt, number 87. And a good pickup there. Gain of nine yards, 10 yards make that. Third and four now. Third and four, ball to the 27 yard line. Shotgun formation. Here's Wild, here's the snap, looking over the middle, flag on the play, going down, rainbowing down, it is caught! And it is Danny Hammond, there is a flag on the play on the short side of the field closest to the booth. So there was a legal shift on the last play. Number 11, Krzorsic was close, it was too close to the line, as here is the pass. 
Wild throws it up for grabs and it is broken up, incomplete. Good coverage and he had a chance for it. It was very close. Good work by the Trojan defense there. I believe it was Anhalt and Moynihan again and they have shut down the Panthers on the outside this evening. Really good work by those fellas. It is now fourth down, eight yards to go, including that penalty. Trips to the top side of your screen. Here's Wild, he rolls off to his left, looking, looking, throws it down, and it is just out of the reach of Krasorczyk, and it is incomplete, and Dodgelin takes over. Good work. There was some pressure there, I believe that was Crutchin, I believe, number 50, who was in there. And Dodgelin, the offense takes back over. Good job on D, and they have really just shut this team down this evening when it comes when it comes to defense. They just have shut them down. Coach Schmini just said it best. We gotta hang on to the ball now if you're Dodgeland. First and 10, 8.20 to go. Here is Nails, the run to Nate A strike. A strike cuts back up the hole. First down and more. Brought down, and they're saying the ball was down. He lost it again. Saying he was down, it appears we have an injured Panther as well. Be all right. It's now first and 10, ball at the 49. Here's the run, Nate A strike again, and he's brought down again a couple yards, a flag on the play in the area of a hold. Cold Fleshman in on the stop there. And it will be a hold. So Dodge will go at it again. First and 19 after the hold. It was a hold. Ball to the 40 yard line. Back to A strike. And he is flipped over. Ezekiel Rodriguez in on the stop number 10. Gain of a couple yards. So after a gain of two, it's second and 17. Ball at the 42 yard line. Younger to the top of your screen. Here's the pass. Younger looking over the middle and it's incomplete, just out of the reach of Zach Younger. They had that one really nice catch earlier this evening, I believe. Was that the, I was late in the first quarter, I believe, coach. And now it'll be third and 17. Third and 17 for the Trojans. Ball to the 42 yard line. Here's the run outside, Matt Moynihan. Stiff arms the defender, he might have enough to get around the corner, yes he will! And a first down and more! Brought down in the open field by Morgan Carpenter and he was able to scoot around the corner. Good blocking up front, as well as Nate A strike in a first down. First and 10, ball to the 30 yard line. Here's Cody Nails. Muff and a fumble again, and so he'll stay with the Trojans this time. Now it'll be second down. It's, it's been a, been an issue this evening for Dodgeland. Has been the been the exchanges from from center to quarterback. Second and ten after the bad exchange. Palmyra Eagle, a lot of movement up on the line here. As Nails wanted a timeout, he didn't, he didn't like something on the line there, and timeout is granted. 5.35 to go. Dodgeland is now out of timeouts. It is 21 to 3. So now it's second and 10. Dodgeland comes straight to the line. And here they go. Nails coming under center, and a quick snap here is to A strike. Took a couple defenders with him. That was Fleischman in on the stop. Cole Fleischman and Cade Fleischman in on the stop. Third down and seven ball to the 27 yard line. I formation, here's Dakota Greenenberg up the middle and he got a couple yards there. Hard running. And here comes Zach Schmidt. He's going to attempt a field goal. Ball is placed at the uh, the 25, 26 yard line. 
Here's the snap, good placement, and it is blocked. It is blocked. Going back is Jacob Bear, and he is brought down. What a play is Zach Schmidt, the kicker. Took him down in the open field. What a play. First and 10 for Palmyra Eagle, ball of the 31 yard line. Uh, trips to the bottom of the screen. Here goes Wild. The short throw is low, incomplete. There is a flag on the play. This is well away from the from the ball. What could you possibly get for that? What could you possibly a hold? So the last call was a hold. I was well away from the ball, as I had once again stated. It's now another first down for Palmyra Eagle, now at the 21-yard line. Now they're in twins. Here's Wild. Rolls out to his right, a short throw, and <laughs> right off of Carpenter, I believe, incomplete. Right off his shoulder pad. Second and 10 from the 21 yard line. Back to Twins for the Panthers now. Here is the snap, low snap, wild, looking. A duck pass over the middle, intercepted, Derek Anhalt. Pass it shouldn't have been thrown, and the Trojans take advantage of it. Good play by Derek, and he needed that one after the, after the last play, and a first down coming for the Trojans. Good work by Derek. He's trying. So from the two-yard line, Dodgson goes first and 10. Nails right up the middle to a strike and drags a defender for at least five yards. Gutenhoff, Butenhoff rather, on the stop. And a gain of seven yards. Second and three from the nine after a good, good run by Nate. Matt Moynihan split out to the right side as an exchange, a fumble on the exchange. And it's going back to the Panthers. And Dodgen cannot hang on to the ball this evening. And luckily it's, luckily they're leading right now. So Palmyra a short field with 3.11 to go in the fourth. So here comes the Panthers. First down and goal from the eight. Here's a run up the middle and Pushing for yardage is Prozinski. First one there was Dan Moynihan. Mitchell Crutchen was there. Dakota Greenenberg was there as well. From about the four and a half yard line is second and goal. Now twins for Palmyra Eagle. Here is the pass. Wild rolling to his right, throws to the end zone. It is caught, touchdown Panthers. Morgan Carpenter, and I mean, with the short field that they had, if you didn't score, then it's, you know. It's a, it is now 21-9, Trojans still up. Here's Cade Fleischman in for the extra point. Low snap, placement, and it is well short, no good. Some issues with the snap on it for the Panthers, and though the score remains 21-9, it is with 2.31 to go, 21-9. And a very likely for an onside kicker, here's Cade Fleischman. A, a booming a short kick to Derek Anhalt. And Anhalt hauls it in. Dodgeland takes over again. Good work by the hands team. So here goes the Trojans again from the 45. It's time management, clock management here for the Trojans, as here is the run for Matt Moynihan from the backfield, and he is ridden down. Prozinski, also Cade Flushman, and Palmyra Eagle is going to use a timeout, I believe. Second and 10 after the Palmyra Eagle timeout. Moynihan, Matt Moynihan to the backfield, they'll hand it off to him. Stiff arms and a fender. Patience in his running, and it, he's very close to a first down. Stays in bounds, too. That's the big thing as well. 
So third and inches now. Ball at the 46 yard line. Here's an eye formation as a, the hard count. Working for the Trojans, for Nails. So Palmyra Eagle just spent their second time out. First and 10, ball at the 41 yard line. Dodging once again with their clock management. Here's Nails to give to Moynihan. Moynihan patience, running to the outside, has a first down and more down the sideline. And he's gonna be ridden down at about the seven yard line by Owen Butenhoff, and great running from Matt. So now it's first and goal. Trojans taking their time to the line. With a minute 40, here's Moynihan. Cuts through and is pummeled. That was Carpenter in on the stop after a gain of a couple. Second and goal now from the five. Nails taking his time to the line. Here he goes under center. And the give to Moynihan, Matt Moynihan. Nothing doing. Now under a minute to go here in the fourth. Dodgeland enjoying a 21 to nine lead over the Palmyra Eagle Panthers. And victory formation, Matt Moynihan. Right next to Zach, Cody Nails rather. And that is gonna do it. So Dodgeland takes care of business in the first half. As the final seconds run off the clock, the final score, the Trojans beat the Palmyra Eagle Panthers. By the final score, Trojans 21, Panthers nine. Good work by the Trojans, is just consistent all evening. Had some issues with the turnovers and that's gonna have to be addressed, certainly so. As